tonight there is a push to make sure every school bus in Buffalo has an aide on board. This follows claims by at least two parents that their child was sexually assaulted while riding the bus this year. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Hannah Bueller is here with more. Hannah? And Ashley, tonight I asked Buffalo Public School officials about those allegations and they tell me as of right now investigations are underway internally and in cooperation with the Buffalo Police Department. Tonight's meeting focused on the need for aides and why there are so many vacancies on district buses. We are told about 70% of all pub Buffalo public school buses are staffed with an aide on board and there are currently about 400 aides working for the district. However, there is a serious problem with turnover. Officials say there are many reasons for this, including pay and shift availability. School officials tell me they're constantly looking to fill these vacancies. Buffalo Common Council members like Ulysses Wingo are pushing for aides on every bus. It really boils down to students not being supervised. I mean, children will get away with whatever we let them get away with. And if there's no one supervising the little people on the bus, then guess what? They're going to do whatever they can get away with. We're looking at, again, recruitment efforts and looking at uh, staff development. We're looking at uh, a lot of different uh, conscious efforts to really look at uh, helping the drivers and the aides along the way. Bus aides need to be available for a split shift during the school day, once for two and a half hours in the morning and two and a half hours in the afternoon. The district wants to staff an additional 200 bus aides to bring it to full capacity. In the next month, the district says it will work on compiling statistics for the council to take a look at. Hannah Bueller, 7 Eyewitness News.